Hello, my beautiful, darling Cancer babies. I hope everybody is safe, happy, healthy, and doing well. For those of you new to the channel, my name is Gina, and this is a Cancerian-only channel. Cross-watchers are welcome. If you would like to view other sign placements, you can go to my main channel, Tarot of Light. The link is below. Um, I do have a Virgo-only channel and a Leo-only channel. Um, you could check that out in the description box below if you have those signs in your chart or if you cross-read uh, for them. Um, please be sure to like, share, comment, subscribe, click that notification bell so you know when my readings post. I do a monthly giveaway on this channel. I give away tarot cards, oracle cards, and crystals. Just hashtag what, like, what you would like to win in the comment section below. Um, readings can be vice versa, so flip it, twist it, reverse it to whatever way fits you and your situation. Um, please keep in mind that these are an, uh, these are situations that may have happened already, are happening, or can happen in the future. So even if you are completely single, please be sure to take heed um, because they could be red flags for you to look out for in the future, okay? All right, so let's get pop in here. Spirit, tell me about my beautiful Cancer babies, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. Tell me about Cancer, please. Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. Tell me about Cancer, please. Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. Tell me about Cancer, please. Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. Tell me about Cancer, please. Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus signs, please. Okay. Knight of Pentacles in the reverse. Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo energy, and the nine of cups tell me about cancer please sun moon rising and venus the five of wands and the page of pentacles very strong earth here guys by the way we've got the knight of wands leo sag aries energy and we've got the three of wands oh too funny we've got the moon card the wheel of fortune and the empress okay so Cancer, this person is kind of cute. I'm not going to lie. Okay, it is a little bit of a cute energy. Um, Cancer, this is someone that wants what they want and they want it now. Okay, so this could be a new person that wants to, um, you know, ask you out or go out with you and you're telling them, well, I can't this week, maybe next week. This could be an ex coming back wanting to apologize to you. Whatever it is, this person doesn't want to wait. Okay, nine of cups, they want what they want, knight of pentacles in the reverse, and they want it now. No, I don't want to wait. Can, what are you doing right now? <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Page of pentacles and the five of wands. This is someone that either wants to apologize after a fight, they don't want to fight anymore, or it could be that this is somebody that sees that you have a lot of competition and they really just, you know, they want to win that competition. Knight of wands and the three of wands, this is somebody that can't wait for the future. So if they're waiting to go on a date with you, they can't wait for that day. Like they're counting every second of every minute of every hour of every day, okay? If if this is someone you know from your past coming back to apologize um, this is someone that can't wait to get to the makeup sex or they can't wait to get to where everything's okay again okay with the moon card the wheel of fortune and the empress what this person's not telling you cancer is that they already know you're the one that this person even if you haven't gone on one date with this person yet they already know you're the one they already have your baby's names picked out they got the wedding venue picked out they got all the stuff and things already uh, in line okay if this is an ex this is someone that maybe hasn't told you yet but they see you as the one see the high priestess secrets here and i feel like with the tower and the sun card if you were to find out you'd be a little mind blown because if it's an ex let's just say they've never given you that impression before um or if it's a new person it may be just because it's you know it, you haven't even gone on a date with this person so how can you know that you want to marry me you know okay so let's see what we have going on here tell me about this knight of pentacles in the reverse and the star card i want what i want and i want it now aquarian energy uh <laughs> four of pentacles with the nine of cups and the devil card capricorn energy cancer this person is obsessed with you possessive and jealous of you this person wants you they're not showing you so you may not know this okay and i i don't feel like it's in a crazy way it's in a good way you know i, I mean i don't think i'm not feeling anything bad as of right now five of wands and the seven of pentacles this person can't stop thinking of you 
they cannot stop thinking of you. If this is a totally new person, Cancer, they are on your Instagram and on your Facebook page looking at every single person that likes your put pictures, looking at every person that you comment to, you know, what competition they have, where you're giving your time and energy. If this is someone from the past, they're looking back at their past behavior, the things that caused fights between you guys, and this is someone that's realizing that maybe they need to change their ways. Page of Pentacles, please, and the Three of Pentacles. This could be someone that you know from the workplace. It could be a friend of a friend, um, or again, it could be an ex wanting to come in and work things out with you, okay? But they're very anxious to get this moving, okay? The Knight, <laughs> the Knight of Wands and the Queen of Pentacles. This is somebody that is, they just want to very quickly get you married they they want to very quickly get to the end goal okay they're not they're not trying to be no knight of pentacles they're not trying to oh well let's take our time let's see where it goes this is somebody that like your first date is gonna be going to try wedding cake that's what your first date's gonna be <laughs> if it was up to this person it would be at a bakery testing to see what wedding cake you guys want this is somebody that immediately wants the commitment Three of Wands and the King of Swords in the reverse. Aquarius, Gemini, Libra energy. <sighs> Cancer, this person's trying to cut corners to get what they want. I'm not gonna lie. Okay. They're 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 this person's smart. Okay. They may not be using their intelligence for the best purposes right now. Okay. They're trying to cut corners to get what they want. And what they want is you because with the queen of cups here and the full card, they see you as flighty at the moment. If you're fighting with this person and they're trying to reconcile, you're out in these streets looking all good, sweet, kind, scrump scrumptious, you know, in your nice little tight dress there. And, you know, or if you're a guy with your nice little whatever, you know, I don't know what the hell y'all got going on. But my point is, is like this sense of urgency because you know if it's someone totally new they know you have a lot of other options and if it's an ex they know that you're moving on okay they know that you're moving on all right let's see here tell me about cancer how's cancer feeling about all this <laughs> You are just totally in your own space right now. Temperance, Sagittarian energy. You're just on the couch. Six, you're not even seeking attention. You don't even want nobody's attention. You got your phone on airplane mode, Netflixing. I don't even want to be bothered. You don't want to be seen. You don't want to go out. You, I, I feel like you just don't want to be bothered right now. I don't know what it is with you, Cancer. You're just in, like, I'm surprised if the hermit doesn't come out. You're just, you don't even want to be bothered by nobody. We've got the Eight of Cups. I feel like you're focusing on emotionally disconnecting from things, uh, making better judgment calls for yourself. Tell me about Cancer, please. You're focusing on healing. We've got the Page of Wands, Leo Sag, Aries Energy, and the King of Pentacles, Capricorn Taurus, Virgo Energy. For some of you, this could be an ex-husband, ex-wife, baby mama, baby daddy, but we do have the King of Wands to the Queen of Pentacles on the board, Cancer. Okay, very stable, solid, committed energy. This communication is going to come in from this person, okay? And it's going to start with a, hey, what's up? How you doing? Okay, and if you, you know, answer one little answer, this person's going to try to rush in. Okay. For some of you, this person may try to break into your house. I'm not going to lie. Like, I, I know that sounds creepy, <laughs> but I'm not sure that it is. Okay. Uh, this person does know that there was a horrible ending between you guys. Okay. Um, this is specifically for those of you that, um, okay. For those of you where it is an ex coming back, they kind of want to rush in. They know that they're lying, they're cheating behavior, they're sneaky behavior. They can't do that again. Ten swords have already been put in your back and now they're coming back to offer that cup. Okay, uh, five of pentacles here. You know, this person knows that they're about to lose you. For those of you that, you know what I'm saying, this is a new situation. I feel like this is somebody that's trying to override the competition before they lose their chance and you find somebody. Tell me about temperance. We've got the chariot in the reverse. You are minding your business. You are not trying to make no decisions right now. You are not trying to leave the house right now. You know, with the nine of swords here and the six of swords, I feel like you're just trying to move on. You're just trying to, you know, move on and heal. Six of wands and the four of swords. I told you, Cancer, you are just on the couch minding your damn business. You got your flame and Cheetos popping. You got your, you know, 
I don't know, cheese puffs or your Doritos, whatever you got going on here. You know, the chocolate chip cookies, got some Oreos. You're living your best life. I feel like Cancer, honestly, money is good, so you don't got to worry about that. You're just straight. Tell me about the Eight of Cups and the Tower. Yeah, there was a huge Tower moment here between you and this person, okay? So whether you have someone new coming in or whether it's the past, either way, you did have a Tower moment with somebody, okay? And you're still trying to heal from that. Um, we've got the judgment card here and the ace of pentacles. Um, so cancer, if this is a past person coming back, there is a decision that you have to make about taking an offer. Okay. Um, some of you may say no. It would appear to me here, cancer, that you're doing just fine on your own. Like you are straight killing it on your own. You know, you're, you know, the, these messages are coming in and you're sitting there in the living room trying to give yourself a whole pedicure or whatever, you know, while watching Netflix. You're, you're just straight mind in your business here cancer you don't got time for none of these people tell me about the page of wands and the eight of pentacles in the reverse this is someone that wants to talk to you about why it didn't work i'm not gonna lie to you okay um spirit tell me about the king of wands excuse me the king of pentacles seven of swords in the reverse cancer this is somebody that's trying to come back in sneak their way back into your life from out of the cold this is somebody that maybe wants to talk to you about the fact that they don't want to lie or steal or cheat or do whatever the hell they were to take advantage of you anymore they you know they're coming in to talk about commitment cancer okay they're coming in to talk about commitment what else do we have here for cancer Wow, we're only at 11 minutes. Let me tell you something. When they say energy comes into your readings, normally my readings are 20, 25 minutes long. Look at how fast this whole reading went. We're only at 12 minutes. That's insane. Tell me about Cancer, please. Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. It's because this person has a very quick energy. Queen of Swords in the reverse and the Fool card in the reverse. Cancer, I don't see you wanting to go out. I don't see you wanting to move on. I feel like with the Queen of Swords in the reverse, you're kind of in an energy of feeling a little bitter about the whole situation. You don't really want to talk to anybody. You're just you're just in an energy of trying to heal right now. You're just in an energy of trying to heal right now. Five of Cups in the reverse. You're trying to get yourself out of a bad place. You don't want to love this person anymore. You don't want to love anybody anymore. You know, I, I feel like that's where your head is at. King of Wands and the King of Cups. Unfortunately, Cancer, I don't know. I mean, you have the opportunity here to have love and to have um, passion in your life. I feel like you may feel like with this person, you guys don't see eye to eye. You're more of an emotional person. This person seems to be more fiery and like just passionate and on the go. You know what I'm saying? Um, you may feel like you and this person are just too different. The sun card in the reverse and the six of swords. You're not happy about it, but I think you're trying to move on. You're not happy about it, but I think you're trying to move on. Five of pentacles, the nine of wands, the three of cups, and the six of cups with the knight of cups. This person's going to have to slow down if they want to reconcile with you. Because honestly, at first glance, you're not interested. I'm, I'm not going to lie. You're not interested. You're just you're just not interested. Um, so if they want to pursue you, there's going to need to be some courting and some wooing and some patience involved. You know, are they going to be able to do that? I don't know. You know, I don't know. All right. So let's take this into the extended. I do feel like for many of you, this could be new love where, you know, you're trying to get over the past and somebody's really trying to pursue you on a romantic level. And maybe you're just not ready to start something new yet. Okay, um, or it could be a past person. So in the extended reading, I'm going to go do two separate readings. One will be for if this is a past person, how will it turn out? Should you stay? Should you go? You know, if you reconcile, what's going to happen? And uh, for others of you where it's just you getting over somebody and this is a very new and very impatient person that's trying to tie you down, um, you know, should you go for it? You know, should you go for it? Would it be a good idea for you? And what the outcome is of that, okay? All right, guys, I love you all so very much. I'll see you in the extended. The link is in the description box below and in the comment section below. And I will be doing Cancer versus all 12 signs in the extended, okay? I love you guys so much and I will see you there. Bye, my loves.